All right, let's start this thing. And boom. Our okay. tale begins here, in the quiet fishing village of Eastern, one of the so-called ten towns of Icewind today. The tiny community is hardly a town, but rather a collection of ramshackle huts crowded together upon the icy shores of Lackdenshire. Here, within a dimly lit tavern, a group of travelers sit huddled around a table, swapping tales and making grand plans for the future, completely unaware of the part they are to play in the events that are about to unfold. They're about to have to go to the store and buy some milk. Oh yeah, I can hit done. What's this? New face in town, eh? Well, my stranger, the name is Rothgar, originally of Hillsaw. But now, after years of traveling up, down, and under Faerun, I am content to call this town my own. Who might you be? Greeting, Hrothgar. My name is Lysander. Well then, welcome to East Haven. <coughs> Whatever your business in these parts might be, I would offer you this small piece of advice. While you're in my town, you do well to be on your best behavior. These folk are under my protection, and anyone who would seek to do harm to them in any way shall answer to me. That said, I'll let you get back to your cups. I'm sure you've had a long journey, and you'll find there's no better way to shake off the cold of the road than by downing a few mugs of Grisella's best. And if you're in need of lodging, I would recommend talking to Quimby over at the Snowdrift Inn over on the east side of town. Equipment and supplies can be purchased next door, at Pomab's Emporium. Uh, Pomab's prices are a bit high, even for a Kalashite. But you'd be better off well-equipped and short of coin than the other way around. Ill-prepared travelers don't last long in these parts. Once you've had a chance to rest up and get your bearings, come by and see me at my house. It's just a couple doors west of here. There's some business I will discuss with you. Farewell. Later. <clears throat> so yeah, this is the game. Um, this is the first room you start in. And it's very similar to Baldur's Gate, the video game Baldur's Gate... Dark Alliance for the GameCube, um, and that you start in a tavern. Of course, just about every game starts in a tavern for them. I don't know why. So uh, let me go over the basics. Basically, you've got your health, which is constituted by constitution and your class. Um, <clears throat> right there, you see that's the armor class, and that's constituted by your dexterity. Every person who has Depending on what your dex is, that affects how much uh, of a class dodge you have. Obviously, the one having the lowest dodge would be um, Fromzian because he has a dexterity of 13. And the higher you get that, the more it is. Going all the way to a negative 4 at 18 until you get some different increases. Then you've got, it's called Thaco. And... I don't quite know what all of it stands for. I know that AC is supposed to be armor class. H, I'm assuming, is hit. And I'm guessing T means try. I don't know. But the way that that stat is determined is that you got your strength and then also your weapon proficiencies affect how much you do. So... Depending on what weapon you have affects how much um, how much an offer how much of an opportunity you have to hit things. But all this will become relatively clear yeah. within the next few videos and whatnot. And you'll be able to figure it out pretty quick. What you want to do first, though, Good. is you want to get party normal party alignments this way, um, and you want to talk to the barkeep. And you want to ask her for a drink. And we'll say, a drink? Of course, dearie. After all, this is a tavern. Plenty to drink here. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, yeah, what's up? Well, she's in a bit of a bind. Apparently, there's something in her cellar. You've run out of everything? Well, no, but there's a... Uh, but what...
And I'm going to insult her weight because my character's insane. I do so hate bugs. <laughs> she didn't like that comment. Act <laughs> civilized towards one another. You can at least be polite, then there's there's the door. Alright, is there anything I can do to help? It's awfully sweet of you, but I don't expect you to do to go through any trouble on my account. And then I'm gonna be a crazier guy. <laughs> I suppose I could scrape together a couple of coins. And I'm just gonna be ungrateful. She is not gonna like me towards the end of this. And of course, you only get one quest from her. So basically, she tells you to go down to the cellar, and then you kill these things. Looks like a and this is when AI comes in, and that's why I'm not clicking to attack things right now. It's a few sure. stuffs. Strong smelling brews. Racks of numerous bottles of wine and other sprites. The thick layer of dust and cobwebs have settled over everything. Yeah. So that's how you get that quest done. Whoa, what was that creepy friggin' thing? Okay, and then you go back and you talk to her, and you get your experience. And she's now happy with me for some reason. All those mean things I said about her beforehand mean nothing. So, yeah. That's your first major quest. And I'm talking to this dwarf for no reason other than the fact that he looks like he might have something. Well met. I be Hildreth, should you wish to know. Um... What do you know about the expeditions? That's a good idea, I'll go find him now. Okay. Yeah. So now... Let's explore the town a bit. Hit the M button, it pulls up your map. G goes back to the game itself. And let's go explore and find all the other people who we need to talk to.